Hi, it's Anthony from okplay.com and today we'll be looking at how to utilize the strap for your touch controller on the Quest 2 as a knuckle strap. It is pretty straightforward. It uses nothing else. It uses just the strap itself and uh, I'll tell you how to do it. Um, but eventually you're just gonna get a nice little discreet and color coded knuckle strap for your controller without spending any money. So let's jump in and let me tell you how to do it. So we'll start with the right controller first. Um, as you get it, you probably get the strap already attached to it. So I'll put that back on. Normally I would have got it rid of it straight away. Um, and um, first of all, let's remove the actual battery compartment, which is a lot tougher now. So battery compartment gone. And then you basically pull this little tab here to lift this little uh, bit out. And we're basically reusing this, this cord. So first of all, we need to pull this uh, the slide all the way back to the, uh, the attachment end. So you've actually got the loop. And then you take the loop end and you pass it down through the center. And then you take this nobule and then pass it through the hoop. And then pull it tight. Now I prefer this method rather than this on the inside because it's a cleaner it's a cleaner line all the way down so once you've done that you can bring this slider all the way up and grasp the top so you've got the slider at the top now and then basically as simple as um, just finding making sure that's nice and flat bring that around and into the actual slot again and push it down and then you need to basically move this out the way so you can actually get the, um, this might come under, undone a couple of times, but let's move that out of the way so you can actually get the trip the door back on the controller and push it shut. And if, it ever gets, if you ever get any problems, it's because the uh, cable is um, in between the gap here. You need to make sure that it's fully in the recess there and then you'll be able to shut the door back again. And that's pretty much it. You've got the, nut, the strap now attached. You don't have to worry about a wrist strap. Uh, and you've actually got the strap uh, if you've got a decent sized hand and it just wraps there and you don't you can uh, throw it and it's not actually going to go anywhere it's obviously not going to be a good replacement to a proper knuckle uh, strap for the um, the Quest 2 but considering there isn't any proper Quest 2 knuckle straps out at the moment this will tie you over until that, that day becomes so that's the right controller just move that there and then I'll quickly do the next one right so we got the left, the left controller as it, as you would have got it with the cable attached so it's a simple case of removing the battery compartment taking your nail and bringing that up and out and then you now have the cable again bring the uh, slide all the way down to the uh, connector end so you've actually got the loop take the loop pass it down through the hoop and then take this module and then bring it through the loop and then pull it tight and once you've got it tight bring that round make sure that that bit's flat oh sorry bring this all the way up slide up just to clamp it and then bring this bit round so that it's flat into the selector there, connector, and then connect it back in. Then move this out of the way and then reconnect your door, making sure that this is always in the, in the slot there so that the door can actually get properly, firmly closed and back into position. And that's it. You've got your left controller done. Can now put it onto your wrist. Sorry, onto your, onto your fingers, and then um, that's it. Cheap knuckle straps using the existing strap for your Oculus Quest. Um, this will tie you by until uh, the proper knuckle straps get released from different manufacturers. But for now, this is a really good way of uh, securing um, the uh, controllers over your knuckles uh, without worrying about the actual strap itself. All right, thanks for watching. 
and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers. Bye.